Hey guys, uh, welcome to what is essentially the pilot episode of a new series I'm starting called Pint Size Playthroughs, where I do a let's play of a game and try to condense all of that content into a single video that is as short as I can get without sacrificing key moments. In today's video, I'm playing a short hike, which is a nice little one to two hour game where you run around an island chatting with the other animals and helping them with whatever tasks they have, with the end goal of climbing to the top of the mountain. Hope you enjoy. Go. We're on the island. Let's go talk to her. Hello, who are you? Hey, how's it going? I haven't seen you all day. You been busy? Uh, kinda. Well, not really. I've just been waiting around for a call. Well, there's your problem. There's no reception out here. Wait. What? Yeah, I mean, pr pretty much no reception. You might be able to get some at Hawk Peak. Oh, yeah, I guess. But that's pretty far, isn't it? It's not that far. We've all made the trek before. I figured you would have get gone already. Oh, yeah. I've been meaning to go, but I just haven't gotten around to it yet. Well, today's as good a day as any. Dot, dot, dot. Just take White Beach Trail and head north at the fork. Then follow the signs for Hawk Peak. No problem. Right, time to go on a short hike. It's over here. Ooh, I found a shell. Boop. Out of the way. Time to go to Hulk Peak. Hey buddy, what's up? Claire! Did you know you can hold A while running to glide through the air? Yeah, I figured it out already. Of course! Everyone knows that. Why do you ask? I don't know. I just had a feeling you might want to know. Um, okay. Check this out. I can go over here. Ooh! We found some money. We found a coin. Another person. I'm circling from above. What's up? Hey, you! Find me 15 shells. What? Why? I want them. Yeah, but why? It's a secret. <laughs> okay. I'll keep an eye out. Keep both eyes out, please. And a stick. Can I beat him with a stick? Oh, shit, I can. Oh. It's sort of. I'll steal them, their shells. There's like a little Animal Crossing star. I don't know the shovel though. Oh, I thought I saw... I see movement. Hey Claire, how's the day of treating you? Well, I'm just getting out of the house now. Ah, it's one of those kinds of days. Yeah, I've been kinda caught up in my head all morning. Hmm? Would you say you feel lost and directionless? Uh, maybe? Well, I've got just the thing for you. Take this. Ooh, I got a compass. To use it, press Y to open your inventory and select it from the items menu. Oh, uh, thanks. This should come in handy. Happy hiking. Compass. Alright, I don't know how... I don't know how useful that's going to be. Well, there's a treasure chest. Money! Oh, another one. I'm just... Dude, there's money right here just for the taking. You missed it. Hey, dude. What's happening? Oh, you know. Just jamming out on the beach. Building sandcastles and whatnot. Sounds like a good time. You know it. Can I borrow your shovel? Sorry, bud. I need it for sandcastle construction. Isn't it a little big for that? Yeah, but that's just how shovels are. You can get smaller ones. Ones made for sandcastles. What? Sounds fake. But if you can show me one, I'd be glad to trade. Sounds like a new side quest. Oh, wait, I gotta get... Oh, I got it. Okay. Oh, more... Sh Dude, I'm getting these shells quick. I got five shells already. What's up, bud? Hey there. What are you up to today? Uh, I'm hiking up to Hawk Peak. That's that's a tough hike, you know? 
You'll need to learn rock climb to make it to the top. You want to join the climbers club? Sure. Great. We've got our third member. Not third. Just another drop in the hundreds of worldwide. All right, all right. Anyway, so first things first. You got a golden feather? Oh, not yet. Ah, uh, you can't climb without one. But you can buy them at the visitor center. They should be pretty cheap. Come back when you bought one. Of course you need a feather to climb. Why didn't I think of that? Howdy. How can I help you? I heard you sell golden, golden feathers here. Ah, we do. You can buy one for 40 coins. No way, I have exact... Wait, do I have exactly... Hold up. Do I... Ah, oh, shit, I'm not even reading this. Do I have... Shit. Coins. I actually... I have exactly 40 coins. Sorry, I was confused. I wasn't sure if you're showing, like, the price or how much I have. Look! I had exactly the right amount of time to go climbing. Let me explain how they work. If you press A while in midair, you can flap your wings for a double jump. But that's not all. To climb up a wall, push against it and hold A. Buddy, I'm going to the rock climbing area. They're going to teach me that. The more golden feathers you have, the more you'll be able to climb and fly. Have fun out there. Whee. Climbers, I'm coming. Whee. Oh my god, you can glide far. What's up, guys? I got a golden feather. Yep. Great. So to get started, you can try climbing the short wall here. Just push against the wall and hold A. Whee. Nice one. Whatever. That climb is easy. Real pros use the big wall. Alright buddy, I'll show you. Oh shit. I'm gonna do a little... I'm gonna do... do some cheating. Do a dino. Shit. Do I have to climb it from the bottom? Whoa, good climbing. Eh, it was alright. Yeah, I did cheat. So, I know you can fly and all, but your stamina will last longer if you climb places instead. Just something to keep in mind. Cool. So what's next? To Hawk's Peak. Oh, okay. I still need to warm up myself, but I'll see you up there. Alright. Alright, see you lads. I'm off. Shit, I lag. I think I'm going the wrong way. I should have followed the signs. Oh, another person to talk to. Hmm. I was planning on hiking to Hawk Peak, but the path suddenly got really steep. Do you think it's climbable? Well, it would be better if I had a golden feather. Apparently, they sell them at the visitor center. Mm hmm. Wee. Blackwood Trail, Hawk Peak. Alright, Hawk Peak's to the left. I'm gonna chat to this person, though. Uh, hmm. Hi. Hi. Uh, are you okay? Uh, not really. I'm supposed to run a marathon race today, but I've lost my lucky headband. I've worn it to every race I've ever run. I. I don't know if I could run race without it. Where'd you lose it? Somewhere in Blackwood Forest. D I think. I can take a look for you. Really? You do that for me? Sure. It's a red headband. I can give you a reward. I could give you a pair of running shoes. Don't you need those yourself? Well, I just got sponsored by the shoe company. They gave me like 10 pairs. Whoa! Congrats. Ah. Uh, oh. Haha. <laughs> Thanks. But, uh... Let me know if you see a red headband. Will do, buddy. Oh, look at what we found, though. A toy shovel. What's up, buddy? Time to trade. Hey, check out the shovel I found. It might be a little more your size. Ah, that's perfect. Let's trade. Wahoo! When you want to use my shovel, press Y to open your inventory and equip it. Keep it fresh. We're going up here now. Ooh. Uh, shovel, shovel, shovel. Press B to dig. We got that money. Let's go. Can I buy a golden feather? Sure, here you go. Ooh, look at that. That's actually all the feathers we had. A boy came by early and bought most of our remaining stock. You'll have to find more elsewhere. Sorry. Damn. But now I can jump twice. And I can climb higher. And there's one right here. Hold up. I gotta climb for it. Look at that. I got three already. What's up, buddy? Hey. What's your painting? Oh, you can't tell. Um, it's supposed to be the coastline. Though, I'm trying to go for a more abstract look. 
Ah, I think I can see it now. It's still a work in progress, but I don't know if I like where it's going. I think I'm going to head over to the Backwood Forest Lighthouse soon. I'm still trying to find the right inspiration. All right, well, I'll see you around, buddy. We got seven shells. Dude, we just started, we're already halfway there to get another the 15 shells. What is this? Just like a little hut. Oh, wait, I just realized when I turned the camera, my guy turns his head. I see a coin over here. What's up, buddy? What are you wearing on your head? Oh, um, weird question, but where'd you get that headband? Uh, I don't know. I've had it for ages. Why? Uh, well, I was just talking to this rabbit. She said she lost her headband somewhere in the forest. Oh, you mean Sue? Maybe. I didn't get her name. She was really worried about it, though. She said it was lucky and she needs it to race. I'm supposed to race her later today. She's so talented, I've been really looking forward to it. Hmm. What if I gave you mine? I'm pretty sure it's the same kind. Maybe she wouldn't notice. Oh, hmm. But then it wouldn't be lucky. Uh, I don't know. Just take it. See if she wants it. Alright. Oh. Oh. What's up, painting guy? You've moved already. Ooh. Hold up, there's some coins around here. Damn, I can... Oh, another golden feather. Let's go. We got four of them now. We're going to be ready for the hike before we even get there. Painter, what you up to? Hey, it's you again. Yup. Classic me again. So, what do you think about this so far? Whoa. This is really good. It's like, better than real life. <laughs> well, I don't think I can compete with real life, but I am happy with it so far. I don't know if it will fit into my exhibit, though. I'm trying to come up with something more interesting. I'm going to follow one of the rivers up to its source. I have an idea for a painting that, from that perspective. Into the treasure chest. Ooh. I think it just gave me like 40 coins. The... The... Helen, the Helianthus... Dissolent... Jesus Christ. The Helianthus Dissolentus Rubber Flower. Hawk Peak Provincial Park's official flower. This unique species blooms instantly in flash flooding conditions, inflating like a water balloon. Experience it for yourself with one of the park's communal water buckets. All buckets are property of the park. Am I... Dude, I'm really... I'm taking the bucket? Ooh! Wing. Oh! My 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 feathers are freezing, dude. Are they stick? What's up, buddy? Hey, kid. You want to buy some golden feathers? Uh, sure. Yeah, <laughs> cool. It'll be a hundred coins, bro. But that's more than twice as much as the visitor center. Go buy feathers from them then. But they're all sold out. Heh. <laughs> I guess you're out of luck. So you're gonna buy my feathers or what? This guy's like drop shipping feathers. Fine. Alrighty then, pay up. This guy's a fucking scalper. I'll beat him with my stick. Hook peak trail. At least seven golden feathers are required to complete the hike. I'll show you I can do it with six. Ah! Wait, if I go around here though, check this out. Taking a little bit of a shortcut. Look at that! Only six. Oh hey, uh, it seems like you've really gotten the hang of climbing. Yeah! Hey, uh, um, I think I'm stuck. Tim! It's too high! What have I done? I can't do this! Tim! Take a deep breath. Try and remain calm. You're doing great! And you know, you can handle this. Can I? What am I doing? Just focus on the next step. You've got this. I've got this. I've got this. Dude, you can't... They're just trying to free solo this. 
You're gonna fall and die. Maybe the squirrel will be fine. He can probably like... Squirrels can just jump out of trees. You're a rhinoceros, bro. You're gonna break your legs. Alright, I gotta get like 20 bucks and I can buy a seventh feather. Ooh, money. Oh, see that's enough for seven feathers. Alright. Hmm. This painting isn't working. What? I like it. Thanks. This park is special to me, but I don't think I'm gonna impress anyone with these. Hey, I'm impressed. I mean, like, leave an impression on anyone. I have to show people that I'm achieving something worthwhile. Like, ac academically. Hmm. I heard there's a graveyard in the shadow of the mountain. I'm gonna try that next. Alright, let's go. Let's go buy another feather and then we'll, we'll search around the island a bit more. There we go. Alright, seven feathers. That's pretty good. Ooh! The golden chest. Eat. With a golden feather. Look at that, I got eight. Okay, there's the graveyard. What are these fellas doing? Hey! Looks like you got the net set up. Are you two gonna play volleyball? Volleyball? Nah. We invented our own game. I think it's gonna be the next big thing. Alright. Claire! I formally challenge you to a game of beach stick ball! Ooh! That means you have to play. Yeah. You have to. It's the law. You can't fight the law. Okay, okay. I'll play. Yay! So, how do you play? Step over to the other side of the court, and I'll teach you everything I know. So, Beach Stick Ball has only three simple rules. Rule number one, hit the ball with your stick. Yeah, hit it real hard. Rule number two, don't let it hit the ground. I mean, for the most part. Julie is the ref, so it's up to her. It's all up to me. Rule number three, believe in yourself. That's the most important rule. Don't ever forget it. That's pretty much it. Are you ready? I guess so. Okay, ready, set, go. I think it hit the ground, but Julie didn't see it, so we're good. Yeah, this guy's good. Ah! Oops! Did I lose? Nope! You can never lose. When you play beach stick ball, everyone wins. Except if you pop the ball. Then I guess you lose. Otherwise, beach stick ball is a purely co-op game. You mean co-op game? Yeah, a, oh, he said a coop game. It means we work together to get a high score. That sounds nice. We get a point for every pass we make. If we can get to 10 points, I'll give you a prize. You already got 10 points. Your score is 16. Oh, well, I guess I owe you a prize. Take this. Ooh, look at that nine golden feathers. You're really good. With your skill, we might even be able to make it to 20, but that would still be pretty hard. Good luck with your beach stick ball. I'm taking, I'm taking this with me, by the way. <laughs> oh. I'm stealing your ball. I'm giving it to the fish. All right, time to check out the funeral painter. Or the, the graveyard painter. Where are you at, buddy? Is this them? No, this is a different person. What's your deal? Hi, my name is Avery. I'm on a quest to become a parkour racing master. Neat. You bet your bottom dollar it's neat. However, I'm trying to find someone to practice with. So, any chance you want to go for a race? Sure. Fantastic. So there's this abandoned building to the west of here. At least, I think it's abandoned. Anyway, I'm thinking we should race to the top of it. Whoever touches the post up there first wins. And also, we should only use five golden feathers during this race. That'll make it more interesting. You ready? Let's race. You might want to find a pair of running shoes. They're pretty crucial to good running techniques. Alright, well, I'll catch you later then. I gotta find that bunny and then I can get the... Ah, and then I can get my, my running shoes. Because I, I have the headband for them. Or at least I think I have the headband for them. Oh, there you go. Hello. Any luck finding my headband yet? Well, 
I found this. Hmm, that's not it. The sweat stains aren't in the right place. Ew, where did you find this? Actually, the turtle gave it to me. They said you could have it. They're looking forward to the race and didn't want you to miss it. What? Really? Taylor the turtle? They're like the regional champion. This headband has to be like at least twice as lucky. Possibly even quadruple lucky. Okay, I'll take it. I'm so pumped. Take these running shoes. Let's go. You can hold X to run with them. However, just keep in mind that running requires golden feathers. Whee! Oh my god. Oh my god, I'm booking it. Whoa! Gotta check out my new shoes. I'm new boot goofing. So how about that race? Let's race. Awesome. Let's do this. Whee! What the fuck? You know how to dive? Oh, that's where you are, buddy. Shit, I should have a flower somewhere around here. Aha! Uh -huh. Check this out. Boing! Oh my god, they're beating me. Get the fuck back here! Oh, oh my god, I'm booking it. I'm stuck in a rock! <laughs> Parkour! <laughs> Let's go! I win! There you are. Are you painting in the rain? Yep. Is that possible? I'm trying. I don't have a lot of time. The exhibition is next week. Oh. Okay. Nothing has been working so far. I finally got invited to show my work in the city. But everyone there is doing amazing contemporary work. I don't know if I can keep up. But your stuff is beautiful. You know who is curating the event? Ian Artsworth. Famous contemporary artist. Ian Artsworth. He personally invited me to participate. And, 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 I'm gonna show up with my boring landscapes. And he's gonna take one look at them and whisper, This fails to resonate with me. And probably karate chop them in half. What? He won't do that. He could. He's also a black belt. So it's definitely possible. Ugh. But you're right. Trying to paint here is useless. Maybe I'd... Maybe I'd have better luck at Outlook Point. Oh, there's a boat over here. Is the motorboat booked today? Nope, not yet. You want to take it for a spin? The rental fee is 100 coins. Might as well, we got money. I do want to take it for a spin. Sure thing. And here's the key. Is there anything I can do? All I want to do is ride the boat. But no, you're not allowed. You have to wait until you're older. Well, guess what? I'm older now. That was five minutes ago. Ugh. Hashtag worst dad ever. Now hold on there. I'll take you out later. But later is a million years away. What about I could take you out? Wait, are you for real? Yeah, I'm renting the boat now. Oh my gosh. Dad, I'm going boating with Claire. Okay, have fun. Claire, you're the best. Just let me get ready. You putting on your life jacket? Nope. Okay. I don't know what you had to do then. Let's go. Woo! Oh my god, we're ripping it! Holy shit, what's up? What's up, guys? Alright, I forgot one more rule. Okay. No boats on court! Get that thing out of here! Alright. Shit, how do I... Eh. Can I go backwards? Oh. Hey, look at... Wait, I can I drive on land? Hold up. Whee! How far inland can we get it? Let's see. <laughs> we're going we're going up to Hawk Peak on the boat. What the hell? What have you built over here? Is that a free golden feather for me? That I can't touch? Okay, there you go. A few days ago, I came up with a sick boating challenge, but Dad wouldn't even let me try it. Oh, Dad wouldn't even try it. Would you give it a try? Why not? Oh, yes. You rock, Claire. I gotta set some stuff up, and I'll be right back. I set up a bunch of checkpoints in the water, and all you've got to do is hit them all in order. If you finish in under two minutes, then you win. Okay, 
I think I can do that. Oh shit. Whee! Oh my god, we're fucking ripping it. Oh, hit a jump, let's go. Woo! What's up? Look directly into the camera. Uh oh. Whoa. Well, that was awesome. That was crazy. Crazy awesome. Uh, it's not starting. Wait, what? Okay, I think it's working now. Phew. Huh. I was getting ready to freak out. Oh, let's go. Woo. Is it just me? Or does something not sound right? We should probably have someone take a look. Dad would know how to fix it, but he kind of told me not to use the ramp. Oh, he's going to be all disappointed in me. Ugh. Maybe there's someone else around that knows, like, boat stuff? There's got to be someone. Right, time to look for a boat guy. Oh, shit. Oh, are you a boat guy? Can I stop the boat, please? What's up, fucking... Donald Duck. A boat is making a weird noise. Oh yeah. Boats make all sorts of noises. They're awfully chatty for a chunk of metal. I reckon you want me to take a look at it. If you don't mind. Well, of course. Let's see what we can do. And that should be it. That's all? That's all. Just bent to prop back into shape. Should be purred like a kitten now. Oh my gosh, thank you so much. I was so worried. No problemo. How'd this happen anyway? Um, uh, we kind of drove it off a ramp. <laughs> nice. I gotta get back to slacking off anyway. Thanks again. Oh, sh Jesus Christ. Sorry, buddy. Fucking up your dad's boat. Can we do the thing again? So, now that we're out of that pickle, did you maybe want to try my challenge again? Uh, but this time with no ramp. Absolutely zero ramps. Just regular good old rampless boating fun. Oh, alright. Oh yeah, let's do it. So I was thinking about last time, and I thought I'd add an extra rule. A rule that promotes safe boating practices. Okay, whenever you hit a rock or something, I'll penalize you by adding 10 seconds to your score. How does that sound? Sure, I can handle that. All right, now we gotta rip it, but we gotta be careful about rip. We gotta rip it carefully. Oh, shit. We gotta rip it more carefully. There we go. We're doing pretty good so far. Seems. Oh, I touched something, but it didn't count. I didn't hit it that hard. Let's go! And that's time, you finished in just 44 seconds. And that's after your penalty. So guess what? You won! Yes! High five. Huh. Too lazy to move. But I do have a gift for you. Buddy, you had a golden feather this whole time. That'll help you get air, even without ramps. Alright, well, I'm gonna leave you out here in the middle of the ocean. I got other stuff to do. So, see you, buddy. Actually, no, that's fucked up. Because I do need to get the shells to that person. So you still have purpose to be. Hey, I got your shells. Ooh, I'll take them. So now what? What? I mean, uh, do I get anything? Nope. Jeez, not even a thank you? That's not very nice. I do what it takes to survive. I never promised you anything. Actually, I do have something for you. A new job. I already have a job. Well, make this your side gig. What if I don't take it? It's your loss. Good jobs are hard to find. So what will it be? Fine, I'll take your side gig. Good. Take this. A shell necklace. And deliver it to the Ranger May. To Ranger May. That is all. Outlook point. Ooh. Where's this? Hey, yo. I was just up at Outlook point. I didn't see you there, though. Whoops. You gotta check it out, though. The view is fantastic. I'm planning on making a few rounds. 
Gotta get that exercise in. What do you mean you were just there? Is it? It's right here. We're seeing each other here right now. Oh. Oh, golden feather. Let's go. Twelve of them. Whoa. This is really good. I love it. Oh, hey. I like it too, but I can't use this. Elk Point has been t painted to death. Has it? You've got such a cool style. Thanks, but it's just a landscape painting. This isn't bringing anything new to the table. I want... I want people to feel something when they look at my work. You were invited to this show, right? They invited you because they know your work is good. I'm sure they want to see this, too. I don't know. I need to think about this. I'm going to find something new to paint. Maybe. I should head back to where I started. Ah, there's a painter here. Let me talk to you first. Is Ranger John going to be in this painting? Oh, who's Ranger May then? Oh, that's Aunt May. That's okay. Is Ranger John going to be in this painting? Yep. He agreed to be in this one because he's the best. Aw, you're, you're going to make me blush. It's okay. I can paint the not, not blushing version if you want. Whoa, this is looking really good. I think I'm just going to paint the things I want to paint instead of painting the things I think other people want me to paint. At the very least, it's making things easier. And you want to paint me? <laughs> well, you're a part of the park too. I just want to capture all aspects of the park. That sounds cool. Oh, also, on my way down from the mountain, I found this. A golden feather, let's fucking go! You got 13 now. John told me you were collecting them, so I thought you should have it. Thanks, John. Okay, now let's go back to Aunt May. This all the way over here. And then they want the necklace. Yo, Aunt May, I got something for you. I've got a delivery. It's from Jen. Oh, wow. It's so pretty. She's such a sweet girl. Collecting all those shells must have been a lot of work. Well, actually, hmm? Uh, never mind. Oh, I remember something. I found this golden feather in the cabin. I figured you could use it. Oh my god, dude. We're getting all the golden feathers. This is weird timing. This is like a reward for delivering the necklace. Uh, no. Huh? Alright, let's go. Now we just gotta make it a hawk peak. What's up, buddy? You got any more of those? Fine. Yes. Do you have any more? He... Oh, I bought all of them. Okay, we have 15 feathers. That's sure to be enough. You still here, buddy? Well, good luck. Shit, it's frozen my feathers. Gotta warm up in the, the hot... The hot springs. And by the fire. Holy shit, you're a big boy. Hold on there, young friend. I hope you don't mind me saying, but you seem a little unprepared. It's mighty cold up here for folks who aren't accustomed. I didn't expect it to get this cold. My fe feathers are freezing up. Hawk Peak is unique in the province for get geothermal activity. If you get too chilly, stop at one of the hot springs. That should give you back your strength. Thanks, polar bear. I gotta make sure I don't run because then they'll, f they'll freeze. Hello. Hey, it's you again. We're almost at the top, but it looks like the bridge collapsed. There might be another way up, or I could just go collect more golden feathers. Well, I got a lot, so I'm going up this way. I'll see you at the top, buddy. And the hot springs. Is this the top already? <laughs> oh shit, it is. You. I, I did it. Hold up, the plug's calling. Cell phone reception. Hello. Hey, Claire. Mom. I'm so glad to hear from you. I've been waiting all day to hear from you. I've been worried. Oh, honey. I told you I'd be fine. Yeah, but you always say that, and I always am. Anyway, how have you been? Well, I'm at the top of Hawk Peak right now. Ooh, wow. I love it up there. May and I used to go up every summer together. It's about time you made it up. Yeah, I know. You're so big now. My little girl's leaving the nest. You wouldn't have any need for a little old mom. But I do need you. I'll never not need you. When I heard about the surgery, 
How come you never told me this was a thing? I didn't want you to worry, but I know you get all worked up about these things. I could have been there for you. You're all alone there now. Really, it was nothing. Everything was fine. I'm just glad you're okay. I love you, Mom. I love you too. Wait, something's happening. Volcanic eruption. Was that the famous Hulk Peak updraft? Uh, looks like it. You should catch a ride on it now, before it fizzles out. I wanna, but I'm kinda nervous. Claire, you can do it. I'll come visit you soon, okay? Also, don't forget to say hi to Aunt May for me. She's probably waiting for you back at the cottage. Bye, love you. Love you too, Mom. Time to go up. Woo! Now, which way is Aunt May? I don't even know from up here. I'm so high up. That's the boat guy. Uh, I can I can't even tell what things are from up here. Damn, I can zoom fast like this. I didn't realize that. Woo! There's a bunch of treasure chests I didn't open. There's a waterfall. There's the parkour eagle. There's Ranger John. There's the climbers. There's the sand city. And here should... I think I went a bit far actually. Shit. Like I ruined the <laughs> the ending by fucking getting lost. Where the fuck am I? I'm on a <laughs> I'm stranded on an island. Who the fuck are you? Yo, this updraft is on point. You can get some sick dives on it. Sounds nice. It's nice. It's nice like some rice with spice. You, you tell him, buddy. Okay. Where the fuck am I? How, how did I get back over here? I swear this was like the other side of the island. Okay. I'm gonna go through here. I don't know how I got so far away from where I thought I was. Over here, past them. And towards Aunt May. Hello. Hey, did you make it to the top? Yeah, it was really nice. I can see why you like it so much. Though, it wasn't exactly a short hike. It was, dude. I'm really tired. Haha. <laughs> well, maybe that was a bit of an understatement. Only a bit. It's kind of been a busy day. Oh yeah? What have you been up to? I played a game of beach stick bowl? What's beach stick bowl? Is it some games the kids play? They're always playing something new. I can't keep up with the youth these days. Oh, I drove a boat off a ramp? You what? I drove a boat off a ramp. Yes, but, well, that doesn't sound safe. It definitely wasn't. Anywho, you hungry? I'm gonna break out the hot dogs soon. Well, I'm kinda tired out. I'm gonna go take a nap or something. Alrighty then, have a good one. Time to go sleep. I think it'd be nice to take a break. Time to sleep. Alrighty. It's nap time. The end. It's a very nice little experience. I think it's a pretty pretty good first game for, you know, a pint-sized playthrough. Um, yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this playthrough. Uh, let me know what you think and let me know any other games you, you think I should play. Thanks for playing. Thanks for watching.